our last pre-departure boat projects. Most of them, yeah. Yeah, I think I feel pretty good. Yeah. Um, we've got a couple that are half done, but that's cool. Like cleaning our tanks? Yeah. 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 And a net? <laughs> a what? What's the plan today? Put stuff in the boat. Okay. That's cool. <laughs> yep. You're a terrible vlogger. Doing a little Saturday projects on the boat. And um, yeah, I've got this drawer. I'm trying to organize things. And there's this drawer here that is a huge waste of space. It's fine if you just want to put your wine bottles in there, but. Um, I would rather put actual food in there. So I'm gonna try to drill it out. Um, I think there's some screws in here that I'm gonna try to get at. It's pretty solid. I don't have any wood chippers. I'm pretty sure it's glued on there. So we'll figure out what, how we're gonna do it. There's so much more room now. It just feels like a way better use of space. I can fit so much more in here now. Look. Right, so I need to install the AIS, so the transponder, um, and the antenna splitter inside this compartment, and I feel like it's a mess, so I'm gonna try to clean it up a little bit, and I'm also gonna mount this old computer as well, somewhere in there. That's us, and then we can go see other ships like this one right here, that's the ferry, Boom. ferry, doesn't have a name for some reason but it's there. Those are Volt batteries, so a Chevy Volt. They are lithium, and each one of these small units is as much as a equivalent to a 200 amp hour uh, lead acid battery. So it weighs about a quarter of the weight of the same capacity. Also have um, three home panels, so 915 watts of solar panels. Uh, I think. I think we'll never have to plug into shore power ever again. We're waiting for the um, the arch, the solar arch is going to go above the bin mini. Looking forward to connect those. We got some solar going on. He hates the power tools. Um, yeah, when that channel splits into, yeah. that's what I got too. 6B, color of the mark. It's so dirty and it smells, and I don't know what to do with all this. Well, we're gonna clean it. So I think our problem is somewhere in here seems to be some or whatever in there so our job today is going to be replace the fittings here and then clean the whole bilge so we can use it as storage because right now I wouldn't want to put anything in there it's gross on the way back home for our last impromptu 24 hours mm -hmm. which is really nice because my mom's birthday is tomorrow and she's happy that we're gonna be there I could have surprised her 
Yeah, you could have. That's what I thought we were going to do. I'm not really into surprises. I was like, hey, mom, we're going to be here tomorrow. I was like excited to tell her. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, so we're going to do that. Pick up the life raft. That's for sure supposed to arrive tomorrow. And then we'll be leaving tomorrow or the day after, uh, depending on the weather. Fred wants to leave tomorrow late at night or just tomorrow night. I want to leave the day after like super early in the morning. I guess we'll just see what the weather and what time we get the life raft and what time we get back yeah. tomorrow. Um, we still have our car. <laughs> yeah, to get rid of that at some point. Why did you take this apart, Fred? Because we wanted to install the life raft, mm -hmm. and we have to have access to this part. But it seems like we can't right now, so we're gonna put it back up there and remove the plate when um, when we have the mast off, probably. When we figure out how we're gonna do it. So for now, the life raft is just gonna go in the after cabin, in the main cabin. Speak it, I hope it fits right. Uh, they fits. Boy, I should send him an email, tell him it doesn't fit right. Uh -huh.